beautiful little kiwis it's kiwi swimming here and welcome back to my channel for another episode of generations super quickly before we start i just want to address something uh that happened in the previous episode i want to like clear some things up because some people are like ah why did you do this why did you do why did you not do this and i just thought i would like explain myself and my actions. Okay, if you missed the memo, basically in the last episode, Cecily got fired, um, but I rehired her instantly because I, okay, for a start, I wasn't paying attention to what the thing actually said. Like I kind of like saw the, I don't know, not even the gist of it. I really didn't know what I was clicking. I just clicked accept, you know what I mean? I was very, I think I was already talking about something and I wasn't paying attention to anything. So I just clicked accept. Cecily took a bribe of 7,000 simoleons and got fired from her job. Um, the reason why I took that back instantly was because A, it was never supposed to happen. I wasn't meant to click that one. And B, I don't think it's in Cecily's character to take a big bribe and put her job on the line. I mean, it's possibly a Michael thing to do, but it, I don't think it's a Cecily thing to do. I don't think Cecily is that stupid. So if you were wondering why I didn't keep her fired, that's why. That's why. I had a lot of people say, like, for realism, I shouldn't have rehired her. And, like, that makes sense. Logically, that is more realistic. But, like, realistically, that wouldn't have happened for me to be true to Cecily's character. Do you know what I mean? I have personalities for my sims. I, like, I have them in my head, okay? I've developed them, like, mad in my head. And that's not Cecily. So, technically, the whole rehiring her thing is actually more realistic than having her be fired. There you go. There's the spillage. <laughs> the spillage. Is that even a freaking saying? All right. But yeah, we're finishing off. Oh, not finishing off. We're picking up in the house again. Cecily's feeling a little nauseous. So I'm thinking she might be pregnant. I actually haven't played this for a little while. No, she's not pregnant. What is she, why'd you throw up? Is she pregnant? I don't know if she's pregnant. I don't... I Okay, honestly, to be completely true to you guys I have not filmed this in like at least a week is she pregnant she just threw up and I didn't really look at why she threw up maybe I should start watching the previous episode before I record things because I'm clearly lost what's going on in here is she pregnant the whole like enrolling university thing is supposed to be blanked out if you're pregnant okay well now Michael's vomiting maybe we're just all a little bit sick here I I really don't know she's she could be pregnant who knows? Uh, it's going to be a shock to us all if she is. <laughs> all right. But um, you there. What's your name? Adelaide. You're actually completely in the way, but it's fine. We're just going to have another chill day today. You know what I mean? I love me a chill day here at YouTube.com. So yep, I tried. All right. So Adelaide, is there anything that I can do with you? Not really. You're kind of a bore. Oh, what I could do. Is since Seasons has come out in The Sims 4 and we have swing sets, I kind of want to use swing sets in this game now. So <laughs> for a start, let's go ahead and get a swing set because they're good for kids. You know what I'm saying? Let's just have that on a on a wee angle there. Yeah, it's very randomly placed, but it's cute. Don't even worry about it. I know what I'm doing. I would absolutely let my child swing here. <laughs> Uh, it's not fenced off or anything, but it's fine. It's secure and safe. Don't worry about it. Okay. Anyway, I'm going to have her go ahead and swing. I want to have Michael swing with her just because I think that'll be really cute. So Michael, if you could just get dressed out of your, um, out of the soaked shirt that you've been sleeping in for the longest time now. I need to give these guys proper makeovers. I know. Um, then you can quickly pee because that's another thing you need to do. And then you can go and hang out with your little daughter. Doesn't that sound like fun? Doesn't that sound like fun? Go push her. Go push her. There you go. Father-daughter bonding time. You know what I'm saying? Oh, crap. He's got work in an hour. Why does work have to come in and ruin all of our lives? I'm just wondering. <laughs> I mean, like, can't relate. I quit my job, but you know what I mean? I want to get a photo of this. I want to get a photo of this. Hey, I'm officially self-employed and not working there anymore by the time this video goes up. I just realized. Okay. Oh, Michael, that's not actually a very nice photo of you. Oh. <laughs> I just want to, I just want to capture the greatness. Oh, look how happy she looks. I want to get a picture of her. Look at how happy she is. Oh, she loves her daddy. She loves her daddy so much. 
I don't blame her. He's a cutie, but she doesn't love him like that. Anyway, apparently he's got work in an hour, which is kind of unfortunate. Although I do think he is about to get promoted to level five, which is not too bad. Um, but I don't think I'm going to keep him employed. Oh, no, no, no. Cecily's definitely pregnant. Yep. Unknown causes. Yeah, she's definitely pregnant. Okay. I remember now. I had a plan. Okay. So Cecily is going to have another baby. And then when she has the next baby, Michael's going to quit his job and be a stay-at-home dad. That was my plan. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that was my... Like, feel free to catch me up because I need catching up with the series more than you guys do. Okay. <laughs> But yeah, I guess we're just going to chill with Cecily until she like throws up and until Michael gets home, which is going to be at 9.30 p.m. That is late. Oh my God, my child's already tired. <laughs> it's 3.51 p.m. She's already knackered. Another big mood. Oh, and what's Co Cora? Cara. What's Cara up to? She's watching telly. How cute. I could teach her to walk. I'm going to go ahead and teach her to walk because I want all my kids to have like I want them to, like, know all of their skills and stuff because, I don't know, I feel like that's quite generations -y to have your, like, kids be good kids. I don't know. That's my, that's what we're doing. I'm going to have my kids be masters of everything. But I'm going to pause training my child to throw up now. Yep. Another big mood. Training toddlers makes me want to throw up. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's go back to teaching her to walk. Oh, my God. You can't go to bed yet. It's, oh. It's 5.30 p.m. Trust me. I feel you, but you can't do that. I don't know why she doesn't have any homework. She's supposed to have homework, but she's got... Did she put it down somewhere? Hey, Phil, how you doing? <laughs> um, I'm a little confused, but can you empty this for me? I just want to keep her awake. You know what I mean? I don't want her to go to bed now because then she'll wake up at like 2 a.m. on a Sunday and that doesn't really... It doesn't really like sit well with me. You know what I mean? <laughs> I don't want my child awake at 2 a.m. on a Sunday. That's that's rough. But yeah, we're just going to speed through because obviously this is not overly eventful and I don't want to bore you guys to death, although I probably already am. I really want this... I want this baby to show itself. I want confirmation that I'm pregnant. You know what I mean? She has 12 days until she ages up into adult. An adult, rather. Michael has eight. Wow, they grow up so fast. Okay. Um, he's he's going to get promoted. For sure. Did she just puke again? Oh my god. Honey, you're going to have to have an early night. Okay. Um, super quickly, can you go ahead and potty train her before she pees herself? Please don't pee yourself. This always happens. Oh my. Every single time. It's my own fault, but every single time. There's no point potty training her for sure. Have a meltdown. Like I want to have a meltdown. Ugh, why did you do that to me? Okay. Uh, let's feed you on the floor. Do you need some food? I might give you a little bit of food. You can have some, um, you can have some yogurt. That should be fine. You don't need a big meal or anything. Cecily's going to stay awake, even though she's dead exhausted, because she's got to put the child to bed. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I know. No, 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 no. Do some laundry while you wait, okay? Let's do some laundry. Wait. Just kidding. We're too tired. All right, I'm going to stand here then. Who's speaking to me? Who is this? Oh my god, Parker, you have got to stop asking Cecily out on a date. She's married to your brother. Oh, you're better than that. No, I'm not going on a date with you. I'm sorry, Parker. You're absolutely gorgeous. Like, look at you. I would tap that. You know what I'm saying. Um, but no, that's just not going to happen today. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Maybe in another life, I will be your girl. But hey, Michael got promoted as expected. He's level four five rather he now makes 142 simoleons per hour and works from 5 till 10 30 p.m see his hours have changed they're getting later it's just they're getting later no i don't want that all right maybe he like works these shifts for a little while and then he realizes that oh yo these shifts are really cutting into my family time because the kids are going to be at school until like how 3 p.m he starts at 5 p.m so he'll be getting like picked up for work at 4 p.m he gets an hour with the kids every day. That's that's not a lot. That's not a lot of time. He deserves better than that. <laughs> so yeah, maybe he like works it for a little bit and then realizes that, hey, this actually freaking sucks and I don't want to do this anymore. I want to stay home with my kids and spend time with them. Because isn't he family? Oh, this whole time I thought Michael was family oriented. Well, I'm still keeping that. <laughs> I'm keeping that backstory, okay? He hates how little time he gets with his children. Therefore, he quits his job to be a stay-at-home dad. 
I like that. Because Cecily gets all evening with them. Like, sure, she's got, um, she has work during the day, but she's got, like, a, she's got the whole, like, afternoon with them. You know what I mean? Michael has nothing. Because Kara will age up. She'll be going to school soon. Um, when is she aging up, actually? Oh, did I just age her up? Okay, well, like, soon-ish, she'll be going to school. Yeah, Adelaide will be a teen soon, so that's even more school. And sure, she'll be home. And it's just, it's not going to work for him. You know what I mean? Michael's a family man now, I've decided. I decided that a while ago, but like, I'm officially laying it down there. Michael is a family man, and he doesn't want to miss out on time with his family. Can you please go to sleep, you little sausage? Just please. All right, but anyway, he's going to go to bed. It's 12.29 in the morning, which I think is also crap. I mean, like, being a parent, I feel like going to bed at um midnight, it's just, no, you can't do that. <laughs> You can't do that unless you want to be exhausted at all times, which I mean, he kind of is anyway, so it makes sense, doesn't it? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I'm excited for that to happen. I'm excited for Cecily to um to pop again. Yes, I, I love when she's pregnant. She's very, very cute. <gasps> is it happening? Oh, she's popping, team. She's popping. We're having our next baby, and I kind of want to, hmm, I kind of want to, um, find out the gender I kind of want to find out the gender I want to know what she's having oh I want a little boy she wants a little boy as well look at this she wants a boy and a massage which she deserves oh I really want to know does Michael have a preference no Michael doesn't care he's asleep <laughs> I really want to oh I'm gonna check the gender why does she have demon eyes when she's in her sleepwear Cecily Wow, she's cute. Okay, um, I'm going to see what the gender is. If you don't want to know, close your eyes. But my reaction might kind of give it away. Okay. Oh, should I do it? Oh. Nope. You know what? I'm going to surprise myself. I'm going to surprise myself. I'm not going to do anything to it. I'm not going to figure out what it is. I'm not going to cheat it for anything. I'm going to, I'm going to wait. I'm going to be a classic simmer and I'm going to wait and see what gender my baby is. Thank you. Oh, that feels so wrong. Like, I want to check what gender my baby is. My game crashes right now. No, we're fine. Um, <laughs> but I don't... No, this is a good idea. I'm going to surprise myself. Okay, sorry for, like, teasing you for a second there because I fully I fully said I was about to check and, like, hide your eyes. I lied. <laughs> I really, really want to, but at the same time, it's, I think it'll be exciting. Let me know what you guys want to have in the comment section down below. I really want a little boy. I think, um, two girls and a boy is absolutely adorable. Can you just imagine his big sisters looking out for the little boy? Oh, and then when he goes through, is like, huh, I'm too cool for school. Ew, my sisters, they're lame. And, like, they all bully each other and stuff. But, like, at the end of the day, they have such a crazy amount of love for each other. That's what I... That's what I want. That's what I want. I want a boy. Please let me have a boy. At Sim God, please give me a boy. I need one. And plus, oh, this is like a house full of ladies. Michael's feeling a little bit outnumbered here. So. <laughs> if he doesn't want a boy, I'm going to be really surprised. But it is Sunday at 5.52 in the morning. Because my Sims have nothing better to do than wake up at that hour, I guess. Yikes. Okay. Uh, you can have some yogurt for breakfast. My Sims eat a lot of yogurt, don't they? It's like ham and cheese sandwiches in The Sims 4. I just, I, I go for them. I go for them. Okay. Kara's sleeping. She'll be asleep for a few hours. These guys, their energy doesn't seem to be going up very fast. I'm kind of concerned about their bed. But having said that, Michael's only been asleep for six hours. So maybe it's actually not the huge deal. I'm making it out to be. But I'm really concerned as to why she doesn't have any homework, though. That's... That's interesting. Okay, I'm going to wake one of the parents up when she wakes up, which is now. Who's got the most energy? Cecily. All right, wake up, you pregnant sausage. Let's go ahead and give our little girl a wee cuddle for the morning. Morning cuddles, you know what I'm saying? Oh, got to make that bed, though. <laughs> I don't think she's going to get a bump in this top. I'm pretty sure there's no, like, actual pregnancy morph for this top, which is mildly annoying, but you know what I mean. Oh, their hair kind of matches a little bit. It's cute. No, oh, these guys are just cute. I love my Generations family so much. Like, I don't know if you guys heard, but I really like this series. It's my favorite to film. Oh, look at 
Oops, that was not what I was meant to take a photo of. Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> I love this series a lot. Moral of the story. All right, you need some breakfast. She needs some milk. Literally. Okay, you go give her some breakfast and you can go and serve up some lovely waffles for your beautiful husband who doesn't have work today. Yay, he can hang out with his child and sleep in because he needs to. Oh, he must be so tired. I love him so much. Anyway. Oh my god, please stop sitting right in front of the sink. Why do you do this? Why does she sit in front of the sink? It really drives me nuts. I might get her a gaming console. She deserves a gaming console, I think. <laughs> I don't know why, but I just, I want her to have one. Where do I even find them? Um, here? Nope, that's not it. Um, oh, here we go. There we go. I was looking for like, I was looking for something shaped like that because like I'm used to The Sims 4 kind of. But nope, it actually looks like a PS3. Not really, but you know what I mean. Kind of. My PS... No, it looks like a PS2. No, it doesn't. It looks like... It looks like literally none of the things that I just listed. Whatever. <laughs> it's something you can play games with. Alright, let's have her play... <sighs> I wish there was like a Barbie game or something. That's what I spent my childhood on. Oh no, I forgot to pay my bills. Okay. <laughs> About to have my stuff repossessed. You know how it is. Oh, you know I'm going to delete them. Oh, no, we'll keep the realism. <laughs> Even though I don't think Cecily would fall behind on bills. It's my fault. Okay, whatever. I'll just... <gasps> ah, she needs potty training. Michael, are you awake? Oh, perfect timing, buddy. Come and train your child. Come and train your child. She's about to pee herself. Not quiet, but she will if I leave her any longer. And I don't want that. Oh, Cecily. Did you really burn the nice, like, meal you made for your husband? Oh, okay. This is literally me. She tried to make waffles. Burnt them. So she's going to have cake for breakfast instead. <laughs> oh, if that's not, like, literally me, I don't know what is. <laughs> Fine. We'll get rid of those. Dang it. You try to do something nice. Cecily, please stop falling for everyone that walks into the house. She's attracted to the repo man. He's literally taking your stuff. What are you taking? What? My oven? Really? That cost me so much money. Oh, he's taking the coffee machine. I don't even give a damn. I don't use it. Go hard, my dude. I won't even notice it's gone, to be honest. What's next? What's next? All right. Come at me, buddy. Oh, we're going upstairs now into the bedrooms. Okay. All right. There's no computers in there, so I don't even care. Oh, he's going into my bed. Oh, what you taking? What you... What are you taking? Oh no, don't take that! Is he taking the- Oh no, he's taking the heat- I thought he was taking the end table. Okay, I don't care about the heater either. That's just a decorative piece. Go on. Try harder. What's next? What's next? Going back downstairs? Is that it? That's it? Okay, I literally thought he was going to repossess the front door for a second there. But uh, I don't even care. <laughs> Doesn't even affect me. Oh, they're gonna go have a water balloon fight. That's so cute. I really want to know what gender Cecily's baby is, but I really don't want to spoil myself. What do I do? Uh, what do I do? What do I do? I was gonna say, maybe I could like close my eyes and show you guys. And, um, oh, I wanted to get a better photo of that. I wanted him to hit her in the face. Um, I was going to say, maybe I could like close my eyes and get you guys to look so you could, um, you know, experience it. But then I was like, no, because someone will spoil it in the comment section. I guarantee it. I guarantee it. Fun sucker. I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right. Can you throw one at her head? Oh, I want one at her face. Can you throw one at your dad's face? I think that'd be even funnier, to be honest. Come on. When does she get a throw? Michael, let her go. Oh. Oh, here we- Oh, I missed it. Ha ha, sucker. Sucker, why don't you hit him in the face? Pr hit him in his pretty little face. He looks like he's in a music video. <laughs> Just, is anyone else getting like major music video vibes out of this shot right here? <laughs> like he looks like he's moving with the beat and it's like a- Yeah, whatever. It just looks- Oh, get him in the face. Come on, weak. Throw it higher. 
Throw it higher. Someone hit someone in the face or I'm going to cry. <laughs> <laughs> he literally moved before she even threw it. Alrighty, but apparently we've been invited to a party. Um, Melissa Ferrara's upcoming party. Let's have a look at this. Um, it's going to be awesome. Signed Melissa. Formal attire, Sunday at 6. You know what? I think I'm going to pass, but thank you. <laughs> Who even is that? Is that a co-worker? Oh, it is. Yeah, see, I'm going to leave your ass behind in a minute, so there's no point hanging out with me. You know what I'm saying? Oh, look at Cecily reading her little book. She's so cute. Okay, can I get you to throw... Actually, let's have a house cleaning day, even though she's pregnant and she'll probably be... Probably be taking it easy. We're going to go ahead and um, take care of the house a little bit. House Kara, she's fine. I need to teach her some skills, actually. Michael, do you want to come and teach her to walk and stuff? This gal can find another way to entertain herself. She can go on um, Bebo. Come hang out on Bebo. That's a good place to go. Browse the web. <laughs> yeah. Make some Bebo skins and make your own like f Bebo business page and like s not sell them, but like give them away. Oh, I did anyone else used to do that? I used to do that. I made Bebo skins and I had a page where like people could download them and people did. I was kind of. I was kind of a big deal in like the this the Bebo skin making community. You know what I mean? I wasn't a big deal at all. That's a lie. I had people download them, but I wasn't a big deal. <laughs> I was a one hit wonder actually. I had like one good skin. Anyway, this is totally irrelevant. I don't know why I'm talking about this, but what I do think I'm gonna do da -da -da -da, is wrap this episode up right here with a view of a sponge, because that's how I feel, like a sponge. <laughs> I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to give it a big fat thumbs up for me. Make sure you leave me all your comments and like feedback in the comment section down below. Uh, let me know what you want the baby to be. I really want a boy, but you guys already know that. Let me know what you want. I'd love to hear it. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. I love you a lot. And of course, I will see you next time. Bye.